Chapter 1. In the Lair of the Leviathan, you explore a vast, handcrafted open world with intricate turn-based combat, as well as a non-linear storyline with rich RPG mechanics. Interact with NPCs, each embedded with unique quests that unlock new areas and deepen the game's world visually and interactively. Your strategic choices in using party members' diverse abilities are crucial in overcoming challenges. The freedom of the story allows you to navigate through everything from small monster caves to expansive dungeons. Character customization is key, allowing you to tailor abilities and skills for varied combat and exploration styles. Every location is meticulously created, offering a unique, engaging experience with every playthrough. Number 2 Forgotten Minds has been covered on this channel before, but it just released so we're looking to give it the old stay-at-home dev bump. Dive into a tactical roguelike RPG where you lead dwarven clans to reclaim the Forgotten Minds of Dovergrad. This game blends fast-paced strategy with deep customization options. Over a millennium since demons and other creatures claim these mines, it's your task to assemble a formidable team of dwarves, each class from axe wielders to mages offering unique capabilities. Equip them with a variety of weapons, armor, and artifacts to enhance their skills for each challenging run through the dynamic, hostile environments. Manage limited turns and face over 50 types of enemies in a game designed to test your tactical acumen and adaptability. For those seeking a bigger challenge, Descent Mode adds punishing modifiers to each run, pushing your strategic skills to the limit. This minimalist, small-scale RPG combines retro visuals with deep gameplay mechanics, encouraging constant adaptation and careful planning. This week's video is sponsored by my over 650 Patreons. A huge thanks to those who are already paying members. Every single dollar helps make videos like this possible every week, so thank you. If you can spare the cost of a cheap coffee each month, you too can help support the channel, this weekly indie game series that supports Gato developers, and my Gato tutorial series. I've got lots more planned for the rest of the year, including a special end of the year announcement myself. My goal is to get to $1,000 a month by 2025, and we're already over half of the way there. So check out my Patreon if you'd like to support the channel. Number three. In this dungeon crawler RPG, you step into the shoes of Gobby, a resourceful goblin navigating an ever-expanding labyrinth. In Dice and Goblins, you engage in turn-based combat where dice become your primary tool for battle. Each encounter challenges you to use strategy over luck as you create powerful combos and adapt your tactics with a dynamic dice pool. Traverse 12 interconnected levels with classic grid-like controls, incorporating actions like walking, running, and swimming across different floors. As you explore, you'll encounter a variety of inhabitants, from friendly allies to treacherous foes. The dungeon offers numerous opportunities for loot, including new dice and items that can be traded or upgraded. With the option to change your dice pool and tactics at any time, each playthrough presents a fresh challenge in a visually distinctive and intricate world. Number 4 In Rift Rift, a unique take on tower defense, you'll fend off waves of interdimensional monsters across a series of vibrant and diverse worlds. The game features predefined tower locations within expansive open fields, where monsters can either charge directly at your base or target nearby towers. As you defeat enemies, you'll collect juice, the resource needed to build and upgrade towers both during and between waves. Successfully surviving these onslaughts allows you to unlock new worlds and gather prisms, which are essential for unlocking additional towers and enhancements. The game's standout mechanic involves navigating rifts in space-time that transport you to different atmospheric worlds, each with its own challenges and opportunities. And before we get to our last spot, congrats to last week's winner, Blood Thief. Be sure to vote for your favorite to have them featured in our new Gato Game of the Awards at the end of the year. And a reminder, just because a game doesn't win their week, doesn't mean they can't appear in the awards. Number 5 in Deep Lands, you embark on a journey through a vast, procedurally generated underground world, exploring ancient remnants of a lost civilization. As a dwarven miner, you'll navigate through destructible cave systems filled with dangerous creatures, intricate traps, and hidden treasures. The game combines roguelike elements with platforming challenges, requiring you to use versatile tools and master parkour maneuvers to progress. The open world design allows seamless exploration of interconnected tunnels and structures without level transitions. The environment dynamically reacts to your actions, and you'll need to stay observant 
to uncover secrets and learn about hidden mechanics. With a dynamic soundtrack that reflects your surroundings and a stat tracking system that records your journey, Deep Lands offers a rich, immersive experience as you strive to recover the ancient dwarven crown and restore your kin's glory.